Concerning the diplomatic dispute with Saudi Arabia, I wanted to ask you whether the uh, whether you can confirm the reports that Saudi Arabia has ordered all assets uh, that it holds, uh, uh, Canadian assets, be sold off. Uh, obviously, Canada will always stand up for uh, our workers and our companies. Uh, we need to make sure that we're, uh, uh, we're protecting Canadian interests in, in any situation. Uh, we continue to engage with uh, the government of, uh, of uh, Saudi Arabia. Uh, the Minister of uh, Foreign Affairs had a long conversation with their foreign minister yesterday, and uh, diplomatic uh, talks continue. Uh, but as the minister has said, and as uh, we will repeat, uh, Canada will always speak strongly and clearly in private and in public on questions of human rights. So what options are under the t on the table to resolve this? We continue to engage uh, diplomatically and politically with uh, the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. We have uh, respect for their uh, importance in the world and recognize that they have made uh, progress on a number of important issues, but we will at the same time continue uh, to speak clearly and uh, firmly firmly on issues of human rights uh, at home and abroad, uh, wherever we see the need. Uh, we have always had a positive and constructive relationship with countries around the world, while at the same time always making sure we're bringing up human rights concerns, because Canadians expect that, and indeed, people around the world expect that leadership from Canada. We will continue, we will do so in a constructive and polite way, but we will also remain firm on standing up for human rights everywhere around the world.